I lost graduation. I lost a prom. I lost going out on dates. He went into prison just a boy, came out a man. Jeffrey Deskovic spent 16 years of his life behind bars for a crime he didn't commit, killing a high school classmate back in 1989. I was convicted um, at age 17 of a, um, of a murder and rape. Uh, despite a negative DNA test showing semen found in the victim didn't match me. In 2006, DNA evidence cleared his name. Deskovic walked out of a New York prison a free man. One of the things that people have been asking about is your research proposal. Now he spends his days in a criminal justice class. He tries not to think about the injustice he's faced, but it's hard when the woman he says could have helped shave six years off of his sentence is being nominated to the Supreme Court. I crossed paths with Judge Sotomayor because I had filed um, a habeas corpus petition and the, and the federal court pro, uh, just below her, hers. The appeal made its way to Judge Sotomayor's court, but it was denied. The reasoning? Because it was filed four days late. So as a result, Deskovic remained in jail. A ruling to uphold a case like that on a technicality in light of the innocence, that's, that is not empathy. But legal experts say Sotomayor's ruling wasn't unusual. It turns out the vast majority of habeas petitions are denied, mainly because of the stringent procedural standards set forth by Congress. Anyone who's outraged by this uh, opinion uh, or by this uh, set of circumstances, and it's, it certainly is uh, something that uh, it's perfectly legitimate to be upset about, uh, and, and more than upset if you're, if you're Deskovic, who had to spend a time in prison for a crime he didn't commit. Uh, but uh, really, the, the person, to, the, the group to complain to is Congress, uh, not the judges. Is there still a board or some authoritative structure that's supposed to review? Deskovic realizes his input is unlikely to change the outcome of Sotomayor's nomination. But it is a chance to tell his story. And for him, that's enough. Every aspect of the system failed me, including judges, including Judge Sotomayor. Bonnie Ghosh, The Associated Press, New York.